Hey everybody, this is Vic from Vic's Creative Corner. Today we are going to be doing an unboxing. And yes, I am actually doing a voiceover to the video of the unboxing because I was so far away from the microphone on my phone when I was actually video recording it. And I should have used my DSLR, but that's okay. Let's get an unboxing. I'm so excited for you all to see this product. Um, this is thanks to Krabs. So thank you, Krabs, for providing the hardware. And uh, I can't wait to start making more creative content on these two particular devices. Mainly, I'll be using one of these devices. Um, here we go. We're going to be doing the unboxing of the first one. The first item that I'm going to be pulling out of this box is going to be the Loop Deck Live. Now, the Loop Deck Live is a very popular deck that is being used by streamers and content creators. Um, and it's great for editing purposes, too. Um, this thing is a very small factor. It is almost identical to the Loop Deck CT, which I just pulled out right now. Um, the Loop Deck CT, however, has a few extra features, and I am so stoked to use this product because it is perfect for my editing workflow. I wouldn't say streaming workflow for myself because I like the dials and the configurations that I can do with the dials to adjust certain things with Lightroom, Photoshop, etc. But the Loop Deck Live can also do the same functions. The Loop Deck Live is pretty popular with some streamers, um, but I do want to point out a couple of things. After reviewing it, playing with them, I can tell you that I like my Stream Deck for streaming purposes, but I love the Loop Deck for editing purposes. Um, there is no multi-actions on this, so if you are looking for something that runs multi-actions, you might want to look at the Stream Deck XL or the uh, Stream Deck or pedal or mini, but it does run macros on the loop deck and that does it with ease. So I was really excited about that feature too. Um, but what we're doing right now is we're unboxing the loop deck live and I'm basically showing all angles of it. And there is a port on the top under that plastic. I didn't take the plastic off because that was actually gifted to somebody. So uh, she's very happy with it. And then what I'm using is the Loop Deck CT, which we'll be doing here very shortly. But I'm looking at the ports right now. And then, of course, it comes with the cable. Um, it's very nicely packaged. And I liked that it was a small form factor. Um, one thing I could probably say is they probably should have provided a better stand. This thing is a little flimsy, so it can pop off at any given time. But for the most part, it's at the perfect angle. And I actually have gone on Etsy to look at certain stands for it. And same thing with the CT. These do not, the CT does not come with the stand. But it is a very beautiful piece of hardware, and I love the dial in the middle. So we're unboxing the CT right now, and I'm going to be showing you everything, including the manuals. <laughs> but who needs manuals, right? All right, so right now I'm actually putting this in front of the videos. That way you can get a very good look, and you can actually see here in just a moment that we're going to be doing a comparison between these two devices. And on these devices, you're going to notice that the interface for the top part is exactly like the live. Um, so the functions are the same. The only thing that the live doesn't have is the lower half of what the CT has. Um, I can tell you that they both come with cables. They come very nicely packaged. And they both run the exact same UI and the exact same interface. You're just getting more features with the CT. Um, personally, I use the CT because it's perfect for editing. Like I use DaVinci Resolve, I use Photoshop, I use Lightroom, and I love this just for the photography and the video editing aspect of it. Um, so for people who are just really into like the photography aspect of it, I love the dials because I get to adjust the color, just the temperatures, etc., with ease. Um, I loved that I could do certain things on another product, but this made it so fluid to change between certain things very quickly. Um, I do have a particular profile that I use that I got from Sideshow Effects as well. And what I'm doing right now in the video is actually giving you a comparison, talking about how the products feel, and they feel really nice. Like the dial in the middle of this thing feels really smooth, and they're very lightweight. You wouldn't think that they would be super light, but they're very lightweight. I just wish the CT came with a stand. Um, so maybe that might be something Loop Deck may need to look into in the future if they decide to revise the product. But they have the exact same interface on the top half. So it is a very great product. Um, 
we'll be talking about the UI in another video, but the UI definitely needs some work. Um, there are no multi actions with this particular hardware either. But I hope you enjoyed the video and the unboxing as well as the comparison side by side between the Live and the CT.